Moving back to the Magic City at the bubble as Velva took on Northern Cass. Bottom of the fifth, Northern Cass down 9-2. And Ari Anderson blasts one to right field. And Avery Davidson turning on the Jets, getting the home plate, adding a run for the Jags. The Aggies looking to extend their lead as freshman Grace Ballas blasts one in center field. And that'll bring in Abigail Huckins, who Florida Georgia line cruises to home plate, making it 10-3. Aggie says they're not finished as Kenley Peterson putting some muscle into the swing as she hits it over the outfielder's head. And that'll bring in Grace Ballas to make it 11-3. And that'll be your final as the Aggies win big. In the finale at the bubble, we had the DLBLC taking on the Wilton Wing Miners. Early on, first inning, Ali Arnold takes a swing, but the throw from third base misfires, and that'll bring home Taylor Zimmerman to make it one nothing Miners. But DLBLC answers right back as Zanna Berkeley chops one through, and that'll bring in Logan Yeastos and Cambry Benno to give the Lakers a 2-1 lead. More DLB in the early going as basketball star Maya Nesham blisters one into right field, and the Miners miss just the ball. And the Lake Show put it on a show as Kyla Rosencrantz comes in. Xana Berkeley comes in. And could it be? Yes, Maya Nesham going inside the park to make it 5-1 Lakers. And the Lakers win big by a final of 17-3. In Bismarck, Legacy hosting Wofford City for a doubleheader. Bottom of the third, ground ball over the third. But the throw is late over the first, and the run scores for the Sabres, extending the lead to 6-0. Later in the inning, this line driving to right center field will be a runner in score all the way from first as the Sabres continue to add on to their lead. But Legacy isn't done yet. Still in the third, a single to the opposite field brings in the fifth run of the frame. The lead grows to eight as the Sabres dominate in game one, 18 to two, and cruise to a sweep with a big win in game two.